Now, speaking specifically about Leah Thomas, um, I don't for one minute believe that swimming had anything to do with her dis decision to uh, gender transition. People don't do that for athletic trophies. They just don't. She's generally a trans woman. Okay, and I believe that her when she says that she was depressed and suicidal when she had to live in a man's body. Okay, having said that, <clears throat> the fact remains that as a swimmer, when she competed with men, she was not outstanding. When she competes with women, uh, she immediately shoots to the top. Okay, and I do think that that um, basically tells us that she really does not belong in the women's category. Now, some people have said that she would win every single time um, if, um, you know, that she throws, that she sometimes throws the, the meat and doesn't do her best in order to lose so she can continue to compete as a woman. I think this is absolute nonsense. Of course, she does her best every time. And of course, she doesn't win every single race. The, she has been on hormones, and those hormones do have an effect. And what's more, no athlete is at his or her best every single time. I mean, you know, nobody is even equal to himself or herself every single time. So it's not surprising that Leah Thomas doesn't win every single meet. Of course, she's not going to win every single uh, competition. The, it, but that's beside the point. The point is that... Um, she has an unfair advantage that uh, renders her uh, victories not only unfair, but not meaningful because they're not real female bodied victories. Um, I also think that um, basically it's, it's kind of sad that another swimmer who tied with her was told, uh, you have to let Leah hold the trophy. In a women's competition, a born woman has to basically play second fiddle to a trans woman. And that just does not make sense. They tied. Why couldn't they both have kind of held the trophy together? Okay, that was Riley Gaines. And um, she was offended by that. And I understand why she was offended by that. Okay. All right. And so I really do think the question is not one of inclusion or exclusion. Um, <clears throat> Leah Thomas should be competing with men, even if she is not an actual man. She was originally born in a man's body. Okay, so trans, I really believe that transgendered people, regardless of direction, should be on the male teams. They should be competing with men. Um, and that's uh, my opinion.